welcome back to my youtube channel i hope you guys are doing well in today's video i'm going to be talking about i guess it's kind of like a personal topic because we're going to be discussing feminine hygiene and the best products to have good feminine hygiene and health i'm gonna try to not be explicit so um feminine hygiene is so 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 important and i know a lot of young girls or maybe just girls in general didn't really have people to teach them and i'm just here to kind of be like a big sister and help you guys out and maybe you know give some other ladies who already have good feminine hygiene just give them some tips and some new products that they might want to try out one of the big factors that contributes to good feminine hygiene is having a good ph balance the normal vaginal ph level is between 3.8 and 4.5 which is moderately acidic so an acidic vaginal environment is protective it creates a barrier that prevents unhealthy bacteria and yeast from multiplying too quickly and causing infections so if your pH balance is off and you get an infection that is what causes smells and um, irritation and you're just gonna be put off you know I'm here to show you here to tell you some good products that you can use that is going to help keep your pH balance where it needs to be and what you're going to figure out is that if you don't have any underlying health issues your body regulates itself let your body continue to do its thing and you might just assist it a little bit if you see what I'm saying the first product that I'm going to be showing you guys is this product right here is called the dr broner's pure cast Style soap this is the 18 in one hemp baby unscented soap um, the ingredients in this soap is water organic coconut oil potassium hydroxide organic palm kernel oil organic olive oil organic hemp seed oil organic jojoba oil citric acid and trocopherol i love this product i love dr brona's products because they are so pure they don't have any artificial colorings like they're all basically this color and they just have all these good natural ingredients in them but this one in particular i'm bringing up in this video because it is unscented in that area you should be using unscented soap sorry guys i had to pause this video because i forgot to mention that you should not be using any kind of soap on the inside of your vagina this should only be used on the outside the inside only requires water the outside is where you use the soap so i just wanted to clarify that in case any of my young ladies didn't already know that now you know most of those soaps like Summer Eve and um, all the other ones that say they're there to protect your pH balance or whatever, oftentimes they're not actually good for your body because then once you start using those soaps, your private area is going to be relying on you to continue to use those soaps. So then say you stop using it, um, it's going to be like, what the heck? Like... I need it I need it to help me and then your pH balance is going to be thrown off or if you just use regular soaps you know that are not meant for down there and then have you know all these different scents and other things with it that can definitely throw it off as well it's just it's very sensitive so the best thing is to get you some of this the next product this product i have so many good things to say about this product because it can be used for so many different things and i absolutely love it so i'm just going to show you what it is this product right here 
what this product is it's al it's aloe vera 100% gel it's pure no colors added and what they say it's for is moisturizer for sunburnt and dry skin um, this contains no alcohol no nothing no colors no alcohol no nothing so so what I'm bringing this up for in this video is um, this can be used to replace your shaving cream if you don't get waxed and you still use a razor I highly recommend using this gel because it's pure um, it it moisturizes and um, it's just a good alternative to a shaving cream I'm telling you guys you don't need all these scented things if you're eating healthy and you're treating your body healthy your smell is just going to be natural and that's what it's supposed to be all these little extra scents and stuff that you're trying to put down there is not good for that area and once you take those things away I'm promising you that you will see a difference in your overall um, feminine hygiene and health so highly 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 recommend this product if you would like me to explain all the other things that I use this for um, that can be put in a separate video but you can leave me a comment down below you know if you are interested in seeing something like that also take a second right now and don't forget to like this video and subscribe because I'm giving you guys some good 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 advice and um, suggestions of different products that you can use so please like this video and subscribe since we just you know we're just talking about the um, olive vera gel and the whole shaving thing my next product that i'm going to show you guys is these razors it doesn't have to specifically be this brand because i just got this from five below i think but my point is that i only use men razors and my idea behind this is i just feel like they work better i feel like they're sharper for some reason and they just work a lot better than female razors i don't know what it is don't ask me this is just my personal opinion but i feel like i always get a better shave and i don't have like ingrown hairs and stuff mostly anytime that i use a men's razor so that's all i use now i don't use any razors designed for females i just use all male razors and trust me they get the job done so that's my third product or tip for you ladies the fourth product that i'm going to mention to you guys is this right here and i'm not specifically just recommending this product this brand which is equate i'm just recommending uh this product in general which is thin thin liners anytime that you're going out if you're chilling in the house then like i you don't really have to wear them but like say you're a female who is you know i don't know how to say this because it's just weird but it's very is moist oftentimes have to change your underwear because it's it's wet or you know whatever those thin liners are very good to use if you're out in public or you're out like for the day say you're going to work or whatever those are just very good to keep everything dry down there because you want to keep it dry you don't want it to be dry sorry you want but you want to keep the environment dry like as far as your underwear and stuff because if it's too moist the bacteria likes to grow in moist places so you want to keep your underwear and everything dry throughout the day because that's just going to uh, limit the risk for infection so I highly recommend using thin liners and I think that I only have one product left and I saved the best for last because this is the most simplest product and majority a lot of people already have access to this product and this is what it is right here this is your water it's so important to drink 
lots of water honestly i am trying to be better at this which is why i get suckered in to getting all these water bottles i probably have had so many of these daggone water bottles and i'm just like my thought is if it looks cute i'm gonna carry it with me and i'm gonna drink it so this is very important to drink lots and lots of water because that's just going to help your body to be able to flush out through your bladder or just have your body to have enough liquids in it to filtrate and just cleanse and get everything out of your body that's all the wastes and stuff can just come out so this is like so 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 important that you drink lots of water and i promise you that you will see a difference in your overall health because water is just important for everything but this video is on feminine hygiene and feminine health and i promise you water will help you out so let me drink my water right now <laughs> Ooh, gotta fix the straw in that thing that is all for this video i hope you guys really really enjoyed it and found it very helpful i hope that it helps out my young ladies or just you know my ladies in general hopefully i gave you some you know products that you didn't know about and that you're going to start implementing i just feel like sometimes with social media and you know all these different products for feminine hygiene and feminine health we kind of get overloaded but i just want to remind you guys that it is very very simple you don't need to overdo it once you start overdoing it kind of just to mess everything up if you guys enjoyed this video please remember to give it a thumbs up also please subscribe and hit that bell notification button so that way you'll be notified every time that i post a video please leave me a comment down below telling me if you enjoyed this video if what other videos you would like to see from me any specific questions that you have about feminine hygiene or anything feminine related that you would like me to answer and i'll be happy to do that so thank you for watching this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye.